dealers come out. Everybody is outside till the killers come out. You ain't eating, you just act full. I'm impactful. Dozen funerals in a month, I got that full. I will give it to niggas in all rap forms. Ignatius out right now on all platforms. Here's something a lot of people don't know about me, but you're about to know. My favorite all-time singing group of men is Boys to Men. And it recently came up, Moochie. Would they be the number one choice for an acapella master class? And I want to hear from you guys and Moochie, but before I let y'all speak, I got to let y'all hear what these dudes sound like doing acapella. I can't just come up here and not give you receipts for Boys to Men. Then I got to tell you why I'm mad with Boys to Men. Here we go. On a perfect day, I know that I can count on you. Ooh, when that's not possible, tell me, can you win the storm? Oh, oh, my bad. Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to tell you, fuck a master class. They need to be in every class. They need to be the music teachers of every school in America. Moochie, debate me. What group can compare or be better than boys to men in terms of acapella? Take six. Oh, oh, oh. I, I got, I look, take six came out oh. before them. Oh. And if anybody know, Take Six Harmony is on point, and they had different octaves. Ooh. But I'll give you this. What's Wanye that? not playing. He's already ahead of it, and this is why he's. This is why they get in this class because he had made his own group with his sons. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And them boys are singing with Mary J. Blige. She's producing them. And they recreating some of the some of Boys to Men's songs. I don't know if y'all go and check on the Instagram on um, Mary J. Blige Instagram. Also, it might be on Juan Ye's too, because those are his sons. Them boys could sing too. And they and, 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 um, and now they're coming out. Yeah, and and some of the songs Boys to Men did that new edition allowed them to do um their sons are doing it too and and the name of that group is one more ain't it one more the name of his son's group one more yeah one more uh, that's name freaking the group. Sharon gate put the name in the um chat there you go thank you now yeah. now y'all if i'm telling y'all boys to men was my all-time favorite group of course there's a story so they my all-time favorite group because when i first heard music on a cd it was when boys to men and tlc and the first song i ever heard on a tv show was boys to men on um fresh prince of bel-air let it snow i was in the sixth grade and from then on they had a, they had a new fan but moochie i'm mad with these negroes you want me to tell you why why because it's not boys to men no more. It's just boys. They had a falling out with my main man that had a deep voice. And Moochie, I'm upset. It, it, but you know, they, they said he left the group for medical reason because you know he has MS. True. So he can't, he can't stand up like that and perform on stage. Let him sit in the wheelchair. I agree too, but look how they got rid of the big guy from Drew Hill. I went to a concert where he was sitting on a speaker because he couldn't get up and do all of that stuff. They could have a chair out there for him. Yeah. I, I, chair, I wonder but, if he could still sing. But see, Moochie, the other problem with them is there are some financial 
things that happen behind the scenes that they haven't worked out. And at the end of the day, Moochie, I just want them to work it out. That's all. Just work it out. Y'all still my favorite group of all time. That's just my little fan beef. But you guys take the cake. 